Hello my little ducklings, this is Dex Ahoy and we are starting a new game today called Sherlock Holmes Crimes and Punishments. Now, I've played some Sherlock Holmes games in the past and they have been subpar <laughs> to say the least. Now, I don't know anything about this game but it looked interesting so I watched a trailer for it and the trailer made it look subpar to say the least <laughs> but you know I'm always up for a little bit of a little bit of a Sherlock Holmes game and uh, we you know thought we'd try something new so here we go new game getting Oh, okay. Loading. Oh, a loading screen already. Today's loading screen cup of tea. Okay, frogwares, interrupt me. Is jasmine tea. I'm enjoying the music. Okay. Yes, I know all the characters. Yep, no landlady brother. No idea. <laughs> you had me there until the very end. Sorry. What is a Wiggins? Is that a Chief Wiggins? Ooh. Actually, it looks quite pretty to be honest. The fate of Black Peter. Each time you complete observation, a brief summary appears on the character portraits. Okay, so this is kind of like... I don't know if anybody's seen the BBC Sherlock. If you haven't, go see it. It's really good. Um... But the way that opening made it seem very Sherlocky. Nope, loading. Oh, I'm supposed to be hitting continue. Is there? A Hold on. Sorry, there's just a flashing light outside my window going off and then off and on and then off, and it was really annoying me. So let's continue. <laughs> oh, loading screen. T. Ah, done. Oh, it's John Watson. Oh, hello. Oh yeah, this was the trailer. What? Okay. Settle down, Holmesies. Oh. L1 to move. Okay, so this is literally the trailer. Ooh, but without that. Sofa, take cover. Let's take cover behind the sofa before we get shot. Holmes is crazy. Yes, he is. Maybe he's... Should stop that. I agree. J -j 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 Tackle him. No? Alright. Fine. I like the glowy. It seems a bit out- I have to say, it does seem a little bit- Shut up, Watson. I'm trying to talk. It does seem a little bit out of place in sort of a period thing. I think if it, this was modern day, that would look alright, but I don't know. I'm alright. Uh, take over. <laughs> I'm gonna look up your row. Uh, no, okay. Oh, loading. Okay, if there's this many loading screens, um, uh, we're gonna be in trouble because I only have half a cup of tea. Oh, is that you, Watson? Yes, of course. It what is. a powerful and sense of deduction you have. Nonsense. I was aiming for the vases. Nonsense. Jerk. Watson, quiet, please. I'm trying to concentrate. <laughs> All right, so there's definitely confident step clinking handcuffs. It must be Lestrade or Lestrade. It depends on how people pronounce it. I think I say Lestrade. Uh, Lestrade. Yes. What is it this time? I was right. He can see me. Well, here it is, and it's a good oh. one, Mr. Holmes. Gentleman by the I name of Peter the same Kerry, person. also known as Black Peter. Black Peter. A sailor, most probably. Mm -hmm. What happened here? Oh. Oh, Mr. Holmes, how could you? That's a landlady. It's the only exercise I've had all week. A grateful client from Limoges sent me a vase collection this morning. I couldn't what? think of a better use for it. Why are you shooting You're up your... your mind. I know. I missed four out of ten. Oh. Given you were blindfolded, that was very good. Can I have a try? What? Am I the only sane one here? No, no, that's all right, Watson. I'm with Watson you. Watson is right, Inspector. A little brain work would be preferable now. Do please tell us more about Black Peter. Do please. Peter Carey. 
Born in 1845 and 50 years old. An ambitious sort, he achieved much success in seal and whale hunting around Scandinavia. Hmm. Retired in 1884 with a small fortune. He invested his money in a property called Woodman's Lee, hmm. near Forest Row in Sussex. It was where he lived for six years and where he was found dead Exposition. Yesterday. Has the investigation already begun? Yes and no. What? In fact, this crime is so mysterious that I would prefer you to join me down. Well, let's go. Let's stop talking about it. An hour to Why? Inspector. Why do we need half Take an hour? Your time and join do you me need to brush your bangs out of your face? The yard first. Or fringe, I should say. Again. What have they done this time? I don't know. They robbed a powder reserve. Oh, I'll no. Meet you at Not Woodman's the powder. I should help Mrs. Hudson here. I also have several appointments that I must keep. You should make him clean up his own face. I shall go alone then. Oh. That sounds so disappointed. Press black blue to open the case book and check your current progress and investigation testament. Expect Woodman's Lee. Ah. Oh, he's a fine looking specimen. Alright. What do I art okay. R nope, wrong one. R what nope. Oh, oh. Hmm. Hmm. I feel like I'm going to... I'm pressing R. Oh, there we go. That means right trigger. <coughs> uh, dialogues? Oh, okay. What is this? A map? Lovely. And tasks. What's that over here? Souvenirs? E echoes? Hello, 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 hello. Met in current case. Oh, I see. I understand now. All right, so this is actually going to take a lot more. Ironically, not ironically. What am I saying? It's just going to take a lot more brain power than I was thinking. Examine my analysis table. It is useful for my work. Oh, so you're going to talk? You're going to talk while we go? Who are you talking to? Excellent. Oh, ow. Get. All right. The controls are very. Who are you staring at, you dirty old man? What? That's. I was right. You're a dirty old man. You go along to Peter Kerr's house. Oh, Mrs. Who are you talking to? I will take care of the mess you've made here. Oh, don't don't make him do that. Why are you making her clean up? You're oh, horrible. What person. a mess! What a terrible mess! I too concur, my lady. Door to okay, research. My archive. I can always consult with it if needed. Can you? Letters. This is where I keep my post. Is it now? Newspapers. My oh my gosh! I can always consult with it if needed. He's a proper hoarder. All right, let's go through here. Holmes's room. It's like, I'm sure he'll say, my archive, this is where I can do blah, blah, blah. My workshop, where I can change my appearance. Oh. Oh my goodness. How oh, cool. I'm going to bespeckle myself. I'm going to, wow. No. Yes. Excellent. Hair and hat. I want a hat. Where's a hat? Yes. Excellent. What? Oh. Name. So I can only use them for specific crimes. Alright, good to know. Wardrobe. I'll probably need to... I don't even want to look at this. I know it's going to say, you can't do it because it needs to be specific. Okay, so I can't jump. going to look over here. Nope. I like his wallpaper. His mouse is super sensitive. I wonder if I can mouse. What am I talking about? Options. Gameplay. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I'm gonna... Ah, I think that's much better. Oh, that's much better. Okay, I'm glad that I fixed that. Let me go snoop in Watson's. What? No, I don't want to go out. I want to snoop in Watson's room. Hey, this dude's going there. That's my stuff. Ha ha ha. P. 
Penny Raid. What? I can't snoop. Ah, ah. Where's your gun, Watson? I need your gun. I don't have a gun in here. What are you, some service man? No, oops, I retired long ago. Shut up, Watson. All right, let's go to Woodman Lee. Nope, I just closed it. There we go. Tea time, loading screen. Cutscene. Can I move around? No. Mm hmm. Is that all we're ever gonna see when he's traveling? Hello? Oh. Really? <laughs> all right then. <laughs> I do like the animation so far. I like the facial facial feature. Oh my god, more tea. Seriously? I'm gonna have to go to pee after the first ten minutes of this. Lovely. Ooh. Oh, I thought he was a bad guy there for a moment. Mr. Holmes, I'm over here. Come on. All right, all righty. Right oh, Governor. Join the start at the Woodman's Lee. Complete. Hello, Governor. I don't want to go that way. I want to go down here and pick some cabbages. What you looking at, Governor? R T R one. Concentrate your attention to find details where others are inclined to overlook. Land around stone pathway. Footprints. Pumpkins. Rutabaga. Oh, I can't go into the... Nope. What happened there? Settle down. Oh, I don't have to keep holding it. Okay, that's good to know. Can I go over here? A woodshed. A broken branch. I see it, Holmes. Nope. Okay. I think that's all I have to see. Yeah, but he's looking at that. No one over... Okay. I'll just continue. What did the heck? Oh, I thought that was some sort of... D creature thing. I didn't think that was the part of a... Tr okay. Getting a bit jumpy here. Talk Mr. to your Holmes. policeman. Hello? No? How do I... What? Don't I need to go inside this? No? What? Oh! Examine! I want to examine the garden. It seems that the garden was well maintained. You're right. Can I go over here? Yes, I can. It seems that the garden was, was well, well maintained. maintained. It seems that walking is up these stairs. Who's this old biddy? Oh, cutscene. Just when I was trying to examine something. Inspector Lestrade, when hmm. will you remove my husband's body? It's sacrilegious to leave him here like this. Is it? As soon as we can, Mrs. You Gary, say I it like some, you have something to hide. You to Mr. Sherlock Holmes. He's a detective. No doubt you've heard of him. I'll wait for you in front of the cabin, Mr. Holmes. You do that. My condolences, Mrs. Carey. Thank you, Mr. Holmes. No. Anything unusual that night? When was the body found? Is there a gardener? I'll say it's a gardener. The garden is very large and well maintained. Do you employ someone to look after it? No. It true. Well, that is a loss. But my husband did my it. My husband took care of it himself. Called it. Okay. When was the body found? Do you remember at what time you found your husband's body? In the morning, at around seven o'clock, I noticed the cabin door was open, but I didn't go in to take a look, for I knew my husband would not have liked it. Why not? What has he been hiding? I dared to glance in through the door and... Oh dear. Was your husband accustomed to receiving visitors? Slurp. Oh no, I don't think so. I mean, he didn't really have many friends. He has quite an isolated life here. After his retirement. Let me see. Can I skip those? Anything unusual that night? Madam, can you tell me if you saw no. or heard So we can't skip any of these. <laughs> At two o'clock in the morning, I heard a terrible scream. Mm. But I thought nothing of it then. Oh, it was maybe he was drunk. I was drunk. Goodness. Evening before the murder. Can you please tell me what occurred on the evening of the murder? 
He well, got drunk. Peter got drunk. Oh. <laughs> See, I can read. <laughs> I, I can write Apparently, this. Whenever that happened, he'd stay all night drinking in his cabin before passing out. No, it doesn't seem like a very happy marriage, does it? What am I thinking? Oh. Uh. Oh, hello. What am I doing? Am I. Ah, here we go. What do I. Cameo. Boobs. Gloves. Uh. Birdhouse? Bird? Um. Trowel? Shears. Shears. That's a murder weapon. I'm missing one thing. Look at her fingernails, Holmes. Look at her fingernails. Oh, close enough. Mm, all right, I'll be nice and say something. You have indeed suffered a great loss, Mrs. Carey. Nevertheless, I believe it will be less of a burden for you soon. Yes. Life with Peter was never easy. But he was still my husband. Mm, he was suspicious. Different, wasn't he? When you first met him upon your return from Plymouth. Yes, how, how do you know? Oh, my goodness, but how <laughs> do you know about that? Uh, how do you know about Pilgrimage? Choose the evidence that confirms the statement of Karen. Oh, I see. Pilgrimage. Oh, I don't know what to do. Let's do Pilgrimage. You undertook a pilgrimage to the Cathedral of Santiago de Compostela when you were young. How do you that know that? That is evident That's from the rosary madness. in your hand. The shortest route for the pilgrim from England to Spain is from Plymouth. I believe that you met Peter Carey as a young sailor, uh, yeah. and you married him soon afterwards. That is indeed what happened, Mr. Holmes. How <laughs> extraordinary! Thank you. Thank Adam. you. <laughs> Uh, I don't want to look at my notes. I'm going to see what's over here. Donk. Oh, can't run into that. Waka 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 waka. Oh. Can I go in here? Shut up, rooster. Qua. Qua. Oh my god. I like the sort of a. T oh. Sort of attention to details. It's saving or doing something over here. Whoa! All right, let's continue. Can I run? No. Can I run? No. No. Oh, Rowan. Wait, what? Imagination talent helps you visualize objects and events. Use in limited situations. Okay, so I pressed a different trigger. What am I supposed to be doing now? Mr. Holmes? You're a... Holmes. Let me in. No. Alright, so I wanted to look at all this before I was rudely interrupted, but... Oh, I need to go talk to him. It seems, it seems the scars are almost melt my turned. What do you want? Peter Carey's body is inside the cabin. Good. We took care not to touch anything. Then let me in. Oh, now it'll let me open. Fair enough. Oh, tea. The door is locked. Wait Sh just a Sherlock. moment, Mr. Holmes, and I'll open it. I locked it yesterday to ensure that no one should enter the cabin and tamper with the evidence. And then the body was ah, gone. Good thinking. Hello, hello, hello. It's what been is it tampered with. It seems to me that someone has tried to force it, Mr. Holmes. Hello, hello, hello. Yes. Let me see with my great powers of deduction that someone has tried to force this door, even though you've just said it. Scratches. There are scratches. There are scratches. These scratches are fresh. How? What? Well, duh. They weren't there the night before, so of course they'd be. Oh my God! More tea. You're Seriously. Right. Someone tried to force open the door. Maybe for this game, I should change it to. Yesterday. Gin or something. <laughs> came here last night. Well, he's not the man for the job. This lock is not a difficult one. Perhaps he did not have the right tool. 